With a lot of my music, the pieces start off as improvisation, so I might have a strong melody or something like that, but I would often play these pieces with just a melody and a chord structure, and I'd often involve other musicians in the performance. And what I've been doing in recent years is going back through my pieces and actually formally compose them, so all of the parts are written out for people to play. I'm Steve Fork. I'm a professional percussion player and teacher of music from Melbourne, and I specialise in music for the marimba. I actually worked as a freelance percussion player for many years, playing all kinds of different music, symphony orchestras and uh, musical theatre. That's how I found myself in Japan. I was touring with a a large group of Australians on a production of a musical. And during that time, I met with Keiko Abe, who's one of the most world-renowned marimba soloists and composer of music for marimba. She offered me the opportunity to study with her in Tokyo. So at the end of that tour, I just stayed there and ended up living in Japan for several years, actually, for six years, I think. This particular model the 6100, it's got a lovely wood grain finish on the wooden rails at the front of it. So this one, um, to me, it has a, a warmer look. A lot of professional marimbas don't have the ability to tune the resonator pipe, which is very important in getting a really good full sound, um, depending on the weather conditions. The thing that I particularly love about these Yamaha marimbas is that, as you can see, it's a very large instrument. It produces a very big sound, so I don't have to overplay the instrument to get a very full dynamic range. So I know that whatever amount of energy I want to put into the instrument, that it will deliver it for me. I think it's become even easier to transport, which is very important to me. I'd love to be playing as a marimba soloist in big concert halls all the time, but the reality is for me and a lot of other marimba players, I'm sure, that's re really not the case. And a lot of the time I'm carrying the marimba myself in my car to small venues and setting it up. And they're all quite light to carry. So I think the design has just been improved in some ways. The thing with music for me is it's never been easy. It's taken a lot of work and persistence. Even now, I still really enjoy practicing and trying to extend what I can do on my instrument. And that's the greatest advice that I can give to anybody. You really have to have a real passion for it. That's the most important thing. For me, it's just absolute love of playing music. And that's why it's fantastic to have this incredible instrument, of course, for me to really enjoy every day when I practice. Thank you.